this video, I will show you how to add a very cheap connection between barrels like this from this one. Okay, these are the tools you will need. I have um, half inch PVC, one male threaded, one female threaded, a little bit of silicon gel to seal it up, and three quarters of drill to make a hole. So I marked about two inches below the ring because I don't want it to be so that my hands will not be too rich when I tighten the PVC out. I don't want it to be too shallow. The water will easily all out of the floor. So I figured out two inches pretty good size. I use this little to pick hole, which is three fourths of an inch. It's perfect size for a half inch PVC. All right, this is the tricky part. Three fourths of inch hole will not work with the half inch PVC stuff. Why? The hole is just a bit too small. And this is not a tight bit. You can't make threading on this hard plastic. And now to make the hole bigger, I place the blade in a diagonal direction so that the blade will eat away a little bit of the extra material. And this makes the hole a perfect size. For the PVC threading. You think this is done? Actually it's not because you want it sealed. If you want sealed, threading from one side is not enough. You have to put a some sort of nut on the back, this side. That's why I said you don't want the hole to be too deep that your hand wouldn't be able to reach. See it's not very far down deep. Just like this one which I did a while ago. You have a nut, actually there's another PVC on the inside of you know you guys can see it yeah so then put a bit of gel between the uh, threads make it sealed Okay, all my four ring barrels has been modified to have the PVC outlet right now. Of course, the first one has only one. The second one, third two, has one inlet, one outlet, and the last one has one inlet only. Okay, next, I will use the uh, compression connector and add them to the end of my inlet uh, outlet like this. Of course I'm going to use PVC glue to make it permanent. Then I will use my irrigation pipe to connect between each two barrels. So the first one is linked to the second one, the second one is linked to the third one, and the third one is linked to the last one. A great benefit of using a PVC connector is this cheap, really cheap, like 50 cents each you can buy from Home Depot rather than a barrel linking solution from Amazon will cost you easily for like 20 bucks only for one connector. Okay, if you're curious, what is this water? Can I use this water for gardening? Please check out my next video, how to use your laundry water.